Can I take your order? What's good with y'all, man? It's your boy Leaky Femi coming at y'all with another reaction video, man. Now, look, 7 p.m. Central Time daily uploads, bro. Do I gotta keep saying it? I don't think I do. Because if I do keep saying it, bro, I'm gonna get your ass one of these, bro. You don't want that, do you? Because I don't think you do. Knuckle sandwich, bro? That shit is disgusting, my nigga. Disgusting. So I don't think you want that. So you better be here on time or else you're gonna get that, buddy. But I uh, appreciate the support nonetheless. Look, this video is called Autistic Kid Bullied by Babysitter. What happens next is shocking. I don't know. Based off his face, he looking like he about to retaliate right now. You feel me? May up the blicky. Who knows? You feel me? I don't know what's finna go on. I gotta tell y'all something real quick, man. Everybody chill. My Burger King headset, bro. It really looks like Burger King now. I only got one. You feel me? I'm gonna get a new pair. Don't worry. Don't laugh. Don't do nothing. I'm going to get a new pair. The high, the wires the wires poking out. It, it, it's going to be all right, though. You feel me? show must go on. But I'm doing much talk, too much talking, man. I got my Burger King headset. Let's get the video cooking. <laughs> hey, stupid. Didn't you hear what I said? Don't tell me you're deaf, too. I said room. Now. Look here, you dumb little monkey. There are rules in this society. And one of them is that stupid people like you have to do what smart people like me tell them to do. Oh, whoa! Now go to your room before the rest of your brain stops working. Whoa! What the? Oh, hi, Devin. Oh, hi, Mrs. Seaman. How are you doing today? Please, call me Tamara. Anyway, thank God you're call here. Call me Tamara. I was a little worried that you weren't going to be able to make it. Uh, because of your college essays? Oh, he in college. Well, please, come on in. Oh, Call great, me Tamara. Why's she trying to flirt with him low-key? Hey, David. Your babysitter's here. It's Devin. Hey, David. Um, by the way, I'm really sorry about that. I just had to finish those essays since I'm about to graduate college, so I can't really let anything get in the way of that. Yeah, true, well, true. Well, I'm just glad that you were able to get it done. I don't know what I would have done without you. I... Got a late shift at the hospital. Hey, y'all hitting those? Or no, I I'm not. I'm not. I'm David passing. On his own in the Just apartment. me. I'm passing on that. He might hurt himself. Oh, yeah, by the way, what's the name of his condition? I'm sorry, I forgot. He was diagnosed with autism. I mean, he's just like any other yeah. boy, except he has a little trouble socializing right. and making emotional connections with people. Yeah, it must be really hard raising a kid guys. like him. I personally don't know if I could ever do that. It is, but, well, I thank God every day for sending him to me. Right. He's my ray of sunshine, and I wouldn't change a single thing. And you got this him. dude trying to be a bully. He's a special boy, but he's going to do amazing things in this world. Yeah, but don't you sometimes wish that you would have gotten a normal kid? Hey, don't say that. Don't say that. Normal? He is normal. In fact, I think he might be better than us. He might be smarter than other areas. Do you areas. know that he got perfect scores in all his high school exams? That's what I'm saying, see? The teacher said that he was some kind of genius. Genius? Oh, well, I, I better go. I don't want to be late for work. Um, I've left $20 on the living room table, so y'all can order a pizza. Nice. Please oh, feed my and god, Devin. Devin, remember that David is allergic to meat, so oh, no sausage or pepperoni or anything like that. Sucks. That sucks. Allergic to meat, bro? Bye, like, baby. I love meat. Oh, I love you whoa, so whoa, much. Whoa, 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 my bad, my bad. Whoa, wait. Please don't leave me, Mommy. Hey, hey, don't worry, baby. It'll be fine. I'm just going to be gone for a couple of hours, and I'll be back before you know he it. He can sense that yeah, dude. David, don't worry. Everything is going to be just fine. That dude don't be yeah, We can watch some of your favorite movies and even order some pizza. Please, Mom, don't leave. I'm scared. David, I promise that nothing bad is going to happen to you. Let's make a deal. If you let Mom go to work, and then when I come back, I'll make your favorite pancakes for breakfast tomorrow. Bro, I ain't had pancakes in a good? minute. None of that think about it. You promise? Waffles better anyway. Waffles Thank better you for promise. sure. If you think pancakes are better than waffles, go <laughs> ahead. 
Go ahead. All right, come on, Libby. Let's go take a look at your drawings. You feel me? Because your taste buds are boo-boo. I ain't saying there's nothing wrong with pancakes, bro, because pancakes do hit. Okay, but if bye, I had guys. To choose I'll see you in the pancakes, morning. My God, I'm choosing waffles. Easily. You feel me? Easily. <laughs> Between sausage and bacon? Uh... I probably choose bacon. I'm not gonna lie. Bacon be fire. Okay, listen here, you autistic little loser. Mm -hmm. Here's the deal. You're gonna do everything I tell you to do and stay out of my way. But he's smarter Most than you. Don't cause any trouble. Now go to your room. But I thought we were going to watch my favorite movies. Right. And, and, and order pizza. I lied. I just said what your ugly mom wanted to hear. Don't even think about telling her any of this. Or I'm gonna hurt you and your little mommy. I Calling the ugly understand. mom is crazy. That's because you're stupid and slow. Whoa. People like you don't deserve to be loved. Now go to your room and leave me alone. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, and then what do he say? I have a bunch of girls that I have to message on Tinder. Bro, relax, bro. Relax. I, I don't get the life. You feel me? I know that's a life lesson, but the guy did nothing to you. If you out here acting like that towards somebody with autism, bro, you're mad at the world, bro. Like, he didn't even do anything, bro. If anything, this will brighten my day to be able to, you know, spread love and joy to another person. That'll brighten my day. You're just mad at the world. I hope he get up and slap the shit out of you. That's what I hope. That's what I hope. I have a bunch of girls that I have to message on Tinder. Most guys my age have been with 100 girls at least. And I've only been with 49. So I have a lot of catching up to do. What? What are you saying? Now go to your room and leave me alone. I have a bunch of girls that I have to message on Tinder. Most guys my age have been with 100 girls at least. And I've only been with 49. So I have a lot of catching up to do. So basically you getting the hoes. We understand, buddy. It's that yee yee ass haircut. I already Hello? know Hello? Or to David. You probably don't even understand what I'm saying. So let me spell it out for you, okay? Go to your room, R-O-O-M. Bro, clearly not listening. Hey, stupid, didn't you hear what I said? Don't tell me you're deaf too. I said room, now. See, Don't you messing me, up, dumb little monkey. There are rules in this society, and one of them is that stupid people like you have to do what smart people like me tell them to do. Bro, please get up. No, slapping now him with the paper is the rest of your brain stops working. Fight him, fight him, fight him, fight him, fight him, fight him. Uh, hey, Slowpoke, don't you know where your room is? Don't tell me you're slow and stupid. Nah, he gotta retaliate, bro. He got to. He's smart. He's smart. Look, they say he was smart, so he need to set up some type of, like, on some Home Alone. I know y'all seen the movie, like, Home Alone before. He need to set up some type of booby trap and, like, you feel me? <laughs> That's crazy. He ain't do nothing to you, bro. David was crying his eyes out. He was feeling depressed and alone. Everything that Devin had told him reminded him of the times he used to get bullied in school. Oh, man. He prayed that his mom would get back as soon as possible and save him from his nightmare. Bro, if you bullying people that's autistic, bro, you need to go to, bro. You need some help, bro. Real talk. Real talk, bro. If you bullying people, period, bro, like. Meanwhile, Devin was sitting on the couch getting busy sending messages to multiple girls, telling them to come over for a super easy lay. But as he was messaging back and forth with the girl, she sent him a text message with a link that was supposed to be for her nudes, but instead it was a virus. What? Devin's phone had been hacked and he received the message saying, got you. Now I'm going to download all your X-rated videos and send them to your family and friends and hack into your bank account and take all your money. What? Devin was about to lose it all. The college of my dreams, everything is gone. Yo, if they find out about this. Trying to get nudes and get a virus okay. is okay, crazy. Calm down. Zay. calm down. It's not that bad. I'm pretty sure I can fix it. Oh God, my life is over. What am I saying? Don't go in there, bro. He tripping. He on one right now. Can't believe this happened to me. This is so stupid. Why me? Oh my god. Because you asking for news on Tinder. Why, why did I do that? I don't understand. Oh, he gonna fix it. Well, he knows how to remove viruses. Oh, nice. 
Hey, simpleton, what are you doing with my phone? Can't you see that someone hacked it? It's not gonna work. Can you actually do you this? Do you hear what though? I'm saying? Is there anything going on in that empty head of yours? What are you doing to my phone? Oh my God, you fixed it. But how? I like computers. But aren't you dumb? Did Not he, really. Did you, did you, did you, did you, did you listen to what she said, you dumb nigga? My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Bro, she clearly said he passes all his, his exams. He just have problems like he kept connecting emotionally and stuff like that. You don't listen, bro. This your problem. You think you smart. Look at you. The weak ass t-shirt and fit outfit on, bro. Take that shit back to where you bought it, bro. Please. It's a common misconception, actually. Right. Just because someone has autism doesn't mean they're less intelligent than people who don't. Right. But why did he help me? Especially after how I treated you. You really didn't have to. Well, my mother taught me to treat everyone with kindness and respect. Nice. No matter how bad they treat you. Nice. Because you can change people by showing them love. Nice. I agree with this whole hard hate. I'm so sorry, David. Except oh. except with racist, not gonna lie. Like, y'all gotta be bored, bro. Like, I don't understand how people can still be racist, bro. Like, I still don't understand. Like, you gotta be bored, bro. I, bro, I'm telling you, the only people, the only people that I've, like, to me, in my experience, people that are racist, bro, it's like they literally have nothing else to do. They're not poor. Usually, most of the time, they have money. You feel me? Because if, if you poor, it's bigger things to worry about than, than just skin color. You trying to find your next meal. You trying to find a place to stay. It's bigger problems than just skin. Y'all just be making up problems on your own, bro. It's got to be. I'm confused. All those bad things I did to you. I let my ignorance of your condition get the best of me. Would you ever find it in your heart to forgive me for all those things I said and did? No, sure. I would say no. Friends? Friends forever. <laughs> nice! Get, uh, sausage pizza. You can't eat that. <laughs> I got you, and I'm just kidding. Of course, I didn't forget about your meat allergy. Uh, cheese it is. I was about to say, what do you think you're doing, buddy? <laughs> nice. After that day, Devin came over every weekend to I'm play with David smiling from and was ear to always ear. available when Mrs. Tamara needed a babysitter. Devin and David became really good friends. It's really important to educate nice. yourself about these types of conditions. You should never judge people based on harmful stereotypes. Nice, man. I hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. Make sure you... Oh, let me go see Everyone what you is say. a human being. And we all should be treated with kindness and respect. Don't forget to share this video with all your friends and family. And also, don't forget to like and subscribe so you can see more videos just like this one. Thank you so much for watching. And remember, here at Generation Hope, we're trying to make the world a better place, one story at a time. Nice. Hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. Nice, nice little life lesson, man. You feel me? Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. You feel me? All that good stuff. I'm going to catch you in the next video. Bye.